Hello, today I'm going to review on this, and it's the Doctor Adventures issue 134, and it was on the 24th to 30th September 2009, it was £2.10, so it says, BBC, like, free cool Doctor Who gift every week, like, Doctor Who Adventures, like, how well do you know the Weeping Angels, like, don't blink, like, top 10 planets to visit, read on an exciting photo story, like, three amazing posters, yes, like, look out, who's this monster, find out inside, look, try and find out what that is, it's a, a grask, yes, like, plus comic strip puzzles wins, right, here's the front, on the back, saying, like, superheroes unite, Batman, Brave and the Bold, volume one, at HMV, get closer, okay, let's open this, Let's, it says what's inside, page eight, mini adventures, the tenth doctor meets his old self, the fifth doctor, Page 23, Comic Danger. Page 10, Weeping Angel Quiz. So, first off, you've got a like Who's Who collection poster of the Sycorax. Like, Sycorax are a race of warriors known throughout the universe. These are boneheaded creatures. These boneheaded creatures tried to invade Earth on Christmas, yeah. Who's Who has a Sycorax? Like, top 10 planets in Doctor Who. Like, one, New Earth. Like in the year 5 billion, when the sun expands and destroys Earth, humans establish New Earth. It is apple-scented apple grass and an underground traffic problem. Uh, I will never get used to this. Mm. N oh, nine parallel Earth. The Doctor calls this Pete's world, where, where it's Rose's dad from, where it, as it's wherever Rose's dad is from. It's where John Lewis created the Cybermen. Yeah. San Hilos, or Hellos, or Hilos. Helios. This is the end of the line, or whatever end of the line. Once roaming through planets, it became planet of the dead when stingrays turn everything, everyone, everyone into sand. Gross. Seven Messaline. Oh, its surface was grim and rocky, but underneath the half of humans fought a seven-day war before working to to terrify the planet. It can't be much further. Six. Ma um, Malacosero. That's at the end of the universe. Malmoth lived an organic Calamarian on this planet. It decayed, but Chantho died. Humans, re refugees, came here to build a ship to fly you to Utopia. Yeah. Ood Sphere, beautiful, cold view. The ICM of the, um, the, ICM of the world of Ood, colonised by humans who enslaved them. Luckily, the Doctor and Donna visited and set them all free. Yeah. Like... Four, the library. The library, so big, it doesn't need a name, just Big V. <laughs> the vast, it was just so dead, so the vast Narada, and we, we can take in the forests. You only need a charge to reach out these wacky worlds, yes. Three, midnight. This time planet may have been a beautiful sapphire waterfall, but also home to a mysterious, creepy alien. Number two, Gallifrey, the Doctor's home planet. Gallifrey was completely destroyed with the Great Time of the Daleks. And number one, Earth. The Doctor loves Earth. It always it's always under threat from alien destruction or invasion. But the Doctor and his human friends work together to keep it safe. Earth is the number one planet. Yeah. Like I I, can you work out which monsters these four eyes belong to? Yeah. Look at that. I know. And then funny hoo ha. Can you think of a funny reaction going here? Yeah. Now, can I move up to year eight, sir? I'm 904 after all. <laughs> the winner. Well done to Stuart Davis, who came up with this funny caption from issue 119's comp. Yeah. Um. Yeah, you've got to try and think of a funny caption there, though, yes. Like, set him us heap. Believe in the Mac or M Mike? I don't know. Status heat eleven and a half. Wizard Towers, snatch at birth and raise the boy at four hundred and twelve in, in the young army. Apprentice, the extraordinary wizard. So it's just like a book. Oh, it's like a book series. It's a, Angie Sage's best-selling series in box bookshops now. Yeah. And now you've got extra adventures like mini ones. So check out our guides. Like, mini episodes. But like, several specials. Okay. Look, the Grask has also appeared twice in the Sarah Jane Adventures, yes. The New Doctor, first shown the 18th of November 2005. 
this 10 minute episode was shown during Children in Need Night in 2005. It begins just after the night Doctor regenerates and features a confused frightened Rose. Rose can't believe what she's just seen. The Doctor, regener the doctor regeneration goes wrong. Look at that. Like in the spectacular TARDIS, Crash Lane into Rose's estate in the Christmas Invasion. Yeah. Like Attack of the Grask, first shown Christmas Day 2005. Watch out, it's the grass. Like, like you can still you can still play. Just go on to bit dot 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 forward slash doctor and click on games. Well, I know you can't. Cause it's, it's expired now. You actually can't play that game now. I don't think. Like Time Crash, first on the sixteenth of November two thousand and seven. What have you done to my TARDIS? Oops. Yeah. Before the Doctor has to put back the shields up, the Titanic bang, yeah. I know the Doctor's forgot to put the TARDIS shields up and the Titanic crashed through, so this is like a prequel to Voyage of the Dam, this one. Uh, music of the Spheres, first on the 27th of July 2008, yes. But, so it's like I said in yesterday's description, like 16 years ago yesterday it was shown and aired. The Doctor composing, yeah. But then the Grask escapes into the concert, wow. I oh, know, literally. Grass on the loose. Yeah. It's a really cool adventures. Like, how well do you know the Weeping Angels? The Doctor's what to trace the victims. Well, a Tommy Wimey detector. That's what they use. Um, yes. The Angels are known for what? The Lonely Assassins. Aren't they known for, for the, the Lonely Assassins? What is Sally's sp surname? It's Sparrow. Sparrow, yeah. Which of these people has been sent back into the Weeping Angels? Like Kathy Nightingale. It's Kathy Nightingale. Where did they hide? Uh. Like West of Dublin, that's it. Like which year were the Doctor and Martha sent back to? 1969. They were sent back to 1969. Yeah, what was the name of the detective investigating the house the angels were hiding? Um, Billy Shipton. It, it was Billy Shipton. Yeah. Who took the tires key from the angels? Sally. Like Sally did, I think. Like Sally took the tires key. What was the defense, what angels defense called? Well, quantum locking. It was called quantum locking. Quantum locking, that's it. Like... Ten, how many angels were there? Four. There were four. There were four angels in the house. Like My Sims Agents. It's an advertisement feature. 20th of September 2009 came out. And then you've got First TARDIS Trip from Rose Shock Factor 5 out of 5. The Orsons have copied Mickey's body and now he's chasing after the Doctor and Rose. Doctor! But. Into the small box. It's huge. Rose checks out, so I get it's just a blue box. I oh, know, look at that. In awe to me of all. The assembled hordes of gents can could not be through that door, and believe me, they've tried. Uh, it's big on the inside. The, the inside's bigger than the outside. It's alien, right? It's called the TARDIS, this thing. T A R D I S. That's time and, rel time and relative dimension in space. They've copied him. Do you even think. Going to get him out, melt. Like they even copied him. You don't even think. And now you're just gonna let him melt. Oh no 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 no! It goes like that. You can't go out there. It's not safe. <gasps> yes. We've moved. Does it fly? Yes. Did I read it? Nat Williamson's favorite scene. Oh, and did I mention it travels in space? It travels in time and space. Yes. Next, I'm, I'm hospital on the moon. Yeah. And then you've got woven word search. Woven words such as blood time doom finger. Like jerk jerk like when Doctor Who books. Doctor Who or autonomy. Autonomy, yeah. And then subscribe today, so a forty percent Doctor Who Adventures. So you've seen that issue before, haven't you? You've seen that one. I don't have that one yet, but it's rare. Well, I could get that one eventually. And this is obviously the one I've got now. There's a vest in her order. And then, the poster. Look. Like, Doctor Who New Earth. 
so it's like a new Earth host. So you got Rose, Cassandra, and then Matra and Casper, I think, presumably. And then, and then the uh, um, ill people in the back logo. And then one of those robotic spiders, Doctor Who knew her. And then you've got Dark Smith scares, like meet all the creatures the Doctor encounters in the Dark Smith legacy books. You've got Robot Ancient, um, no, what? Robot a Agent, like Crash Ox, like Dark Smiths, like Dravidi Dravidians, like Blaska or Blaska. And then the Vampire of Paris, Freaky Fangs. Oh, it's horrible there, I know. Like the Vampire of Paris, yeah. And then you've got the Nocturnes, the Nocturnes, Win the Darksmith Legacy books. There you go, you got it there. And you've got Create a New Gadget for the Doctor, so it's another competition. Can you invent a cool tool for our comic strip? Alright, so. You get to see what it's called, what it does, and then, like, it makes a noise and all, and then you've got, <laughs> so they reveal eventually in, in, in a future issue who is the winner. Like, Stormforce, New Greenies, again, look at that. And then you've got who wins. Like, in which episodes the Weeping Angels appear? Blink. They appear in Blink, yeah. Like... The first monsters Rose met were the Autons. First monster that Rose met were the Autons, yeah. Like Doctor Who Foot Soldiers comic. Foot Soldiers. Yeah. So that's really cool, okay. Like next week, Wolfgang gets the shock of his life. And then you got the last poster, like Never Get Clever in Never Get Clever in Latin, Donna and the Fires of Pompeii, yeah. And then now you got puzzles like horrible halves, face halves, like hidden horror, and then parallel pictures from Utopia. Spot the difference, yeah. And then time agent upload, so whoever gets the top two agent upload wins a copy of the next Doctor on DVD. So, um, this guy got it. Gordon Conshaw, nine, cool K9, top time agent. Thea R. Cotter, yeah. Like, Cyber Dalek, Matt Tolan 12, or Tolan 12, Cyber Control Jack Blake, when, that's it, Run, Callum or Salium or Callum Barwick 10, I, I don't know if I can say that name right, I'm really sorry, You Will Obey, like Charlie Hobbs 11, and then DW, my, my granddad made this canine out of cardboard boxes, Thomas Wilkinson, that's really cool, good canine, yeah, and then... In the next Doctor Who Adventures issue, next week in Doctor Who Adventures every Thursday, it says, free Cyberman head frame, upgrade yourself, yes, plus Doctor Who training card set one, actual cards may vary, plus people have become Cybermen, like top ten funny moments, are the essential re, -re for Who fans, on sale Thursday the 1st of October 2009, yes. So, yeah, that's it for this video, guys. I hope you guys enjoy it. Make sure you go consider like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.